The company which makes ejection seats for the RAF has been fined more than £1 million following the death of a Red Arrows pilot. 35-year-old Flight Lieutenant Sean Cunningham died in 2011 when his ejection seat activated during pre-flight checks at RAF Scampton in Lincolnshire. Martin Baker Aircraft Company Limited admitted a breach of health and safety legislation and was sentenced today in Lincoln. Well, Gemma Dawson is there for us now. Gemma, what was said in court? Well, Joe, the judge spent more than an hour explaining her sentence, finishing just before one o'clock by announcing that £1.1 million fine for the ejection seat manufacturer, Martin Baker. She said it had been a sensitive sentencing exercise and paid tribute to Sean Cunningham's family, who she said bravely and patiently sat through these very difficult proceedings. Sean Cunningham's two biggest fears were being ejected and dying at a young age. Tragically, in 2011, a year after being selected for the Red Arrows, those fears became a reality. Sean's ejection seat unintentionally triggered during routine checks on the ground at RAF Scampton. His parachute attached to his seat then failed to deploy, meaning Sean crashed back to the ground. Today, more than six years on, his family arrived at court for the sentencing of the ejection seat manufacturer, Martin Baker. Sean died on the 8th of November 2011. Two years later, his parents agreed an undisclosed settlement with the Ministry of Defence after the MOD admitted liability for the incident. In January 2014, an inquest heard this crucial nut and bolt had been over-tightened on Sean's ejection seat, stopping the parachute from working properly. The manufacturer of that seat, Martin Baker, knew about the issue and told some foreign air forces, but not the RAF. In September 2016, the health and safety executive said it would prosecute Martin Baker, and in January this year, the company admitted a breach of health and safety legislation. Now, nearly six and a half years after Sean's death, a sentence for the guilty firm. Well, during the judge's sentencing, she referred to a victim statement prepared by Sean Cunningham's family, in which they said he loved life and he lived it to the full. He was, they said, the perfect son and brother. She also referred to the six years of hell experienced by Sean Cunningham's family. And now, nearly six and a half years after his death, they now know that the ejection seat manufacturer, Martin Baker, has been fined £1.1 million. Gemma, thank you.